at Beatman Town High School. <laughs> Students are running their own business called Eagle Treats. The Eagle Tree business um, that was started by Dan Rillahan maybe seven or eight years ago and it's just grown and grown over the years. It's all part of the Career Development and Occupational Studies program where students that have physical or learning disabilities can gain practical skills. They market them, they do all of the work in the businesses, and um, it, gives, it gives them good experience. Special education teacher Scott Miller says the students make the dog treats they sell every school day from scratch. They have a recipe they follow. Uh, they mix it um, with a KitchenAid. It needs to be rolled to about a quarter of an inch. So we have actual rollers that will roll just a quarter of an inch for the kids that need to work on that skill. Once they're rolled out, then they're individually cut with um, cutters that are in the shape of the bones. And they're put in um, little cookers, we call them. And they're almost like a George Foreman cooker. Once cooked and cooled down, they're counted, packaged, and ready to sell. We sell in bags of 40 or 50. Um, this year we've already done 29,000, over 29,000. Nearly 30,000 dog treats. Miller says the kids make about 600 every day, each bag selling for $6 with half the proceeds being donated. $3 of that goes right to the Elmore SBCA to benefit their SNP and STOP programs. Miller says that this program is not only helping the students right now, but for when they leave high school. We saw the need for these students to be able to see within themselves that they have the ability to enter the workforce right after school and we feel that we will have given them the skills they need to do that if that's what they choose to do. In Beatmantown, Josh Mitchell, NBC5 News.